But we are the home team, 25 and 16 Larry Ballers bringing in the 23 and 17 sirloins. The top of our order looks amazing right now. Azure still healing. A relevant thing. Zeros is being relevant, everybody. Extreme ego. Mojo and Fitness Duo not always have to be predictability. Oh man, the top of their lineup is rocking too. Look at this. Oh man, this is going to be a game. This may be the game of the week. Brought to you by Pyramid Investments. Lloyd Cook, Mick Steele, and Hammer Longballo do up. Sir James on the mound. One of the pit best pitchers in the league. But here's Lloyd Cook. He is on fire and juiced. He was fooled. But SKS is going back for that one, and that should be one away. And we are off to a start. One pitch, one out. Mick Steele locked in. He's fit. Sir James delivers. Strike one on the curveball. Strike two on a 100-mile-per-hour fastball. High and inside. Oh, just missed the corner on this. Current, the change up there. Oh, that's a grounder. Reaver comes in for it. Throws. Just barely in time. Two way. Now got it. Number 90, the One man double play, says Lethal. Hammerlong Ballo looks at a 101 mile per hour fastball. Swings at the changeup. Got him on the off speed. Oh, that's a ground ball. SKS takes it off a couple hops, and that should retire the side, and it does. Nice inning for Sir James as he stares down the dugout of the sirloins. Sirloins vying for a wild card playoff spot over in the American League, desperately trying to stay in. Larry Ballers do up this inning. Why so slow? Captain Pete and SKS. Now batting, number 47, the right Why so slow? He's been on a tear here of late. They've got Manny Kays on the mound, though. He's locked in already. That's hit, but goes foul to the left side. Ooh, two and one. Way inside, Manny K is a little all over the plate. That one's hit, and that's going to push the count to full. And that's hit. Willard Wiggins takes it, throws, and one away. Here's Captain Pete. He's jacked and juiced. Which is what he's calling his new sneakers that are due out for sale next week. And Pete sends one to right. It's brought to you by Pyramid Investments. You give us your money and you'll get nothing in return. But that is an RBI return for Captain Pete, who hits his 13th home run of the season, his 33rd RBI. Manny Kays doesn't know what to think about that one, but that's what happens when you leave it right over the plate. Here's SKS coming off a terrible game, which ended his hitting streak. And he'll hit that one. A dive by Bobby Bash. SKS running and just beats it out. I need the hallelujah thing. Hallelujah. How in the world do I outrun something? The sirloins. Oh, Lethal got a piece of that one, but it goes foul. That's a base hit the left field. Lethal keeping the runners going. Now Reaver Axis steps in. Two people on base. He lays down a butt. Fair ball. Oh, and they get the lead runner. And Reaver. Reaver, you didn't bunt it the right way. Because it would have been the smart play if you butted it down that way. I, I even leaned forward. Typhus, I thought if I took it down the third base line, it would have been perfect. And we failed. Right. 
We'll be fine. He says, knowing that they're going to lose now in the future. <laughs> and there's a strikeout, 103 mile per hour fastball in there by Sir James. Here's Willard Wiggins. We've... Oh, and Lethal will not get to that one. Oh, almost a throw out there from the outfield. There brings up Bobby Bash. They got one. They won't get two to retire the side. Here's Momo Tobo. He's from Nigeria. He'll pop that curveball. Let's see what Sir James has for him. High fastball, 102 mile per hour. You're not going to hit that. And that sets them back down. The sirloin so far have only squeezed out one hit. Here come the ballers again. Reaver, you should have you should have listened to the manager better and bunted that way. I have no idea why you bunted it straight ahead. Boxicus puts one. Oh, if it finds the gap, it could be multiple base. It gets past him. Boxicus goes past first. Boxicus is going to round second. He's heading to third. He's going to be greedy, and he slides in there for a triple. That brings Travis the unknown. He's got his average up to 255. Listen here. One and two to Travis the Unknown. And he'll swing and miss on that one. Now batting number Mark so with the under pits. I never wanted to coach anything. It was a lot of pressure. Ball one from Manny Kays. Ball two. Anoni just taking the pitches. Oh, way outside, 3-0. and oh. And that's a four-pitch walk. K's just not there right now. And that brings up Sir James. He's locked in and juiced, a 160 batting average. He'll take ball one. I don't know why he swung at that. That was ball two. He'll miss the pitch. Oh, and they double up by throwing out the runner. Oh. <laughs> the greed not working today. Larry Baller's trying to push. That, that's why I stream every game, Theorist. You figured it out. Ooh, 103 mile per hour fastball. Rush will set down. Now back, number 41, the pitcher. Manny Kay is coming up the bat. And his regular fastball is 102 miles per hour. Manny Kay is swinging at everything. And there's another strikeout. Sir James feeling it. But here's Lloyd Cook. He is on fire and juiced. He'll take strike one. Hmm. Pulled him, got him on the pitch. Sir James, keeping the sirloins at bay. Top of the lineup due up for Larry Ballers. Now batting, number 47. Larry now, Zenus, I don't say that. I contribute to the person hitting the home run. Strike one, the why so slow? And there's going to be a base hit to center field for why so slow. So the leadoff runner for the Ballers on here in the bottom of the third. Brings up Captain Pete. He's one for one today. He had that home run. He's pushing his average on up toward 300. That's a pitch out. They were expecting it. And why so slow? Barely gets in there. 2-0 to Captain Pete. 3-0 to Pete.
And that's going to be a base hit for Pete. And that will move so slow over to third. And Pete on first. That brings up SKS. Yeah, their catcher almost got us. Bouncer, that's probably a double play there. It is, but the run will score, so a sacrifice there, but it took off another base hitter. That brings up Lethal D Feline. Don't know why I swung. There's gonna be a base hit if it finds the gap, it's trouble. It oh, 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 hold on. Go back, Lethal. The glove hand is strong for the center filler. And this brings up Reaver, who failed miserably at bunting earlier. But Le Reaver hits that one. If it gets over the head of the center fielder, no. And that will end the third. One more run on the board for the Larry Ballers. Sirloin's due up this inning, though. Mick Steele, Hammer Long Ballo, Tish Ballin. Now batting. Steele's 0 for 1. The first base. Strike one there. Oh, got him on the curveball. I thought that was low, but the ump gives it to him. The ump had a word. Here's Hammer Long Ballo. You know he's due. He'll hit that one. SKS will pick it up. That's a routine round out. Here's Tish Ballin. She's been working on her tan from this game. Let's see what Tish can do. Bowed off. Oh, she'll swing at that high slider. She'll pop up that changeup. That was way inside. It really just hit him on the top of the helmet. Oh, my God. I can't believe that. Oh, sweet Jesus. And she'll go down on the fastball. <laughs> he slid. <laughs> Uh, Aaron Boxicus, Travis Unknown, and Anoni McLarge do up. Boxicus had that triple earlier. Boxicus hitting this one deep. It's got a chance to get to the wall. Oh, and the right fielder, it caught that. Travis the Unknown, 0 for 1 today. Travis goes opposite field. That's going to bounce. That's going to be a single for him. Now back, number Noni. The catcher. Noni feeling a little tense. Fouls that one off. That's going to be 0-2. And a Noni strikes out on the curveball. Manny K is feeling a little bit better after that. Here's Sir James. He is on fire and juiced. And he'll hit that one right to the second baseman, and that will end the fourth. We go over to the fifth. Do nothing. Larry Ballers. Here's Willard Wiggins. Look at that. Bad pitch. That's popped up. Why so slow on the run for it? Waves off Pete. Pete still runs. Pete didn't even pick his head up. Pete just ran. Now batting, number 30, the third baseman. This is our ballpark, guys. Bobby Bash. Fooled by that. Two strikes. I didn't know I had any uh, Yankee gal. That one's fouled off. Get him on the high fastball. That would smoke, but lethal. Picking it up off the ground, and they call it an out. Number 27, the catcher. Oh, that one's just hit. Sir James will handle that, and that's a nice inning. Another zero goes on the board. Gabintus, thanks for stopping by. I appreciate it.
Two runs on eight hits. They're going to try to add to it this inning. Top of the lineup, due up for the ballers. Now batting, Why so slow? The right field. You just made the list. Morlock, thank you so much. Four months. You are on the list. And there's a base hit. 96 power. Oh, center fielder misplays it, but that will keep that will not allow the runner to advance. Yeah, no joke, Zeros. Thank you again, Morlock. Thank you for picking me. I appreciate that. Oh, they pitch down. Why so slow is in there with his another save. Or another steal. Not a save. Captain Pete taking strike one. Two and one to Pete. Oh, that was hit straight to the third baseman. Why so slow struggles to get back. Now back, number 22, the second baseman. Big red machine, SKS, comes up to bat. He smokes that one. That's got a chance to score. Why so slow? Why so slow? Rounds. And that will allow SKS to trot up to second. An RBI double. And that brings up Lethal Feline, who is two for two on the day, batting over 400. One ball to Lethal. 2-0. Re and O the Lethal D Feline. There's a strike. And that is a walk as Lethal with the nice eyes. Well, skedaddle over to first base. Here's Reaver. That's a base hit. Uh-oh, that could be a double play ball. Wonder at the end of the last stream, SKS was the league batting average, but Lethal had over four. Yeah, I would say that Lethal surpassed me for that. My own teammates are going to knock me out. Here's Damian Rush, 0 for 1 today, but batting over 300 on the season. So he's probably due up a hit. And Sir James is starting to slow down a little bit on his pitching speeds. Strikeout, though, on the slider. Was it that one uh, sportscaster just got in trouble for a comment he made about a slider? He said in history, slavery wasn't the worst thing he'd ever read about. It was a slider. And uh, they, they punished him. I'm not sure if he got fired or not, but the people took offense to it. Yeah. Yeah. When you compare a pitch in baseball to uh, a historical event like slavery, you're probably not going to make it long on TV. Ooh. Pitch. Not by Kanye West. And a strikeout, Sir James. He's a robot today. Six scoreless innings, giving up one hit. Boxicus, unknown, and Anoni McLarge do up. Now batting, number 23. Uh, yeah, Marriage and uh, Roseanne Barr was just an idiot on her tweet. There's things you can make jokes about, but then there's certain things you don't say publicly in text. And she totally did that. Travis the Unknown. Manny K is getting beat up today. Surprised he's still out there on the mound. That's a high pop-up coming in. Yeah, I was thinking that too, Zeros. Here's a Noni McLarge. How's that one off? There's another pop-up. No, J2, I was talking about, like, comedians and stuff, where she's a comedian. Like, a lot of comedians say stuff at their shows. And it's a given that you're saying things to be funny, but... Saying things in text on Twitter like that, that that's not going to get you anywhere. Oh, and that's a nice hit by Sir James that will advance the runner, and he picks up a base hit. Now batting, number 47, the right field. 
Oh, smash, but straight to the right fielder. Ham Long Bolo catches that. And that will end the seventh, or the sixth. We go to the seventh, three nothing. Here's Mick still, 0 for 2 today. Sir James is still jacked in juice, but we'll see how long he can keep going. Sir James has been a robot today. I mean, look at this. Oh, that was in there. Change up finds the outside corner. Here's Hammer Long Ballo. Mm, that's bad pitch. Oh, SKS cannot get to it. <laughs> now back, number 29, the left fielder. Oh, this could be a double play ball. And it is! And that will retire the side. Nicely set up there by Reaver to SKS to lethal. to Pete SKS and Lethal DP line are up this. Now batting, number 15. Captain Pete is jacked and juice still. All two. Pete crushes that in the center field. That's going to be another base hit for him. Bye, Marion. Thanks for stopping by. Have a great night. Have a good day tomorrow at work. I'm sure the rest of us will as well. JD is coming in to pinch hit. In this case, we'll pop that up out of play. Ball one there. She's bringing some heat. And that's hit right to the first baseman. That's over to second, and that's back, and that is a double play ball. Lethal Feline, two for two today, and a walk. It's ball one. Ooh, that one tickled the side. Mm -mm. And Lethal sends that one, and that's going to be a three for three day for Lethal Feline. Plus the walk. Not a bad day's work. Reaver Axis, he's feeling a little tense. Yeah, but that's going to be a base hit. That'll help that. So two runners on, two outs here in the bottom of the second. Larry Baller's looking for some security. That brings up Boxicus. Oh, she throws out. Thought the runners were going. Boxicus crushes that one. But foul. Oh, that one's hit. That's in a nice spot. Oh, I thought he was in there. Reaver called out at second, and that ends the threat. We go to the eighth. Willard Wiggins, Bobby Bash, and Momo Tumbo. Now batting, number 21, the shortstop. Okay. SKS gets it on the hop. One out. Bobby Bash up the bat. Oh, he rockets that one, and the sirloins get on the board. There goes the shutout. He takes a slider and knocks his 11th home run of the season. And just like that, we have a game again. Now batting, number 27. Momo Tombo is up. He'll swing at that and miss. Now Damian Rush. Right. 
Fastball's down to about 94 miles per hour. Uh oh, that's fouled off. Look out, Lloyd! Oh, almost took him out. Bad pitch there. Got him on the slider, and that will probably be the last pitch for Sir James. Eight innings work, three hits, one run. Now batting number three, the left fielder. Oh, what a base hit there. That tumbles into the outfield. Center fielder will pick it up, toss it back in. Noni McLarge, 0 for 2 today, but got a walk. That's hit straight to the second baseman, over to second, and the first, that's a double play. You know, I'm going to let Sir James bat. He popped that one up. I think Sir James, if there's a pitcher that can get a hit off a home run, I think it would be him. Bottom of the lineup. They're going to bring in Kamen to close this up. Unless Kamen's not capable. No, he's good. Oh, good lord. Kamen, what are you doing? Captain Pete back for it, though. That was a long way to get it out. That just... I was on the mark, and then all of a sudden it's like, oh, no, you're not. Came in all over the place. Three balls. That's a walk. Oh, don't you do this game. Don't you dare put hammer or mix steel or hammer along ballo up here and have them hit a two-run shot. Got him. Hammer long ballo. Pops it up. Came in underneath it. The Larry Ballers pull out a close game with the Sirloin. 16 hits scoring three runs. Three hits and one run for the Sirloins. Pete's probably your player of the game. Or lethal. Sir James picks up his seventh win of the season. For experts at beating the meat. Oh my god. Heyman with his 11th save. Sir James, your player of the game. Eight innings pitch, three hits, one earned run, 13 strikeouts. Captain Pete. Second place, three for four, home run, RBI, and a run. I didn't know he had that many strikeouts going on. That puts us 26 and 16. It's a rare day. Oh, look at the Grim Cats. Grim Cats are dangerous. They come from the bottom of their division down there to lead. The Reapers, we gotta play them soon. Rebooters, scoring a lot of runs. Compers with another win. We've had some big games lately. Nemesis and Swoops. The Nemesis get a win. That just makes our whole division more cloudy. Oh, the Streamliners got beat. Wild Pigs picking up a win, so that puts them, what, a half game behind? No, a game behind us.
Sirloins and Blowfish. Blowfish get the win. One, two, three, four is the way our division goes. Let's see if the streamliners can bounce back. No, they get beat by the moose. Swoops, they need a win here. Oh, the swoops come back from eight down the win. But the Grimcats put up another one. And the Wild Pigs get a win. The Reapers, we gotta play them soon and they've been putting some serious runs up. Cockatoo's rocking the Chompers. So we're only a half game in the lead over the Wild Pigs. Hey, Nicholas. Again, our division's just crazy. 